I was at a pet store once and I was browsing through the store grabbing toys and I saw this tug I looked in the back of this toy and the label had a warning to it and it said that plain tug something along the lines of plain tug with your dog can cause aggression and I couldn't believe it because up to that point I had always seen that myth as just a myth that just made its way into pet people's ears by rumor but when I actually saw it on a label it really told me that this is such a strong myth such a common myth that it actually made it to the label of a toy some company actually heard of this myth and decided to put a warning on a toy and the bottom line is playing tug with your dog will not make your dog aggressive it just won't if your dog or if a dog does develop some aggression it will not be because it played tug it might be more than likely because of some other factor that the person is not aware of so if the dog does develop aggression it's probably something else it would be like me playing Legos with my son or playing Nerf gun with my son and because of me playing with my son somebody will look at that and say hey if you do that you your son is gonna lose respect for you and your son is then gonna start talking down on you and that's not true if that does happen it will be because I have failed as a parent in another aspect not because I play with my son not because I lower myself to his level while we play Nerf gun and it's the same concept with playing tug with a dog it will not make the dog aggressive now the dog should have a sense of boundaries when you play any sort of game with a dog there has to be a sense of boundaries and it has to be a game it should be fun for you it should be fun for the dog and if it's done that way your dog should not develop aggression problems as a result of that